Hi everyone, my name is Misha and I'm a junior Pamplin Fellow and the head of the 2019-2020 Teacher of the Year Committee. Every year, the Pamplin Society of Fellows bestows the Teacher of the Year Award to one professor. This award aims to honor undergraduate faculty members that go above and beyond the duties of their position to enrich student learning. Each year, the recipient of the award and all five finalists are honored at a celebratory banquet. This year, we aren't able to hold a physical ceremony but we have decided to continue the tradition of the award and make this video as a virtual alternative. Being on the Teacher of the Year committee, especially this difficult time, is a great opportunity to remind yourself how many exceptional professors Lewis and Clark has and how grateful the students are for them. So let's hear from some of the students who have submitted the letters for the finalists. So after transferring into Rachel's 206 English class at last minute this semester, and also having her as my faculty advisor, I have had an in-class view of her as well as many one-on-one -on -one discussions. My writing has only advanced because of Rachel Cole. She took the time to teach me grammar on the level of the sentence. Rachel has been one of my favorite teachers since the first class I had with her my freshman year. I'm now a senior. She teaches with such a deep understanding of her material, as well as a passion that comes into our classroom like every single day. Rachel helped me improve. Rachel took the time to help me with my writing. She invested in me. That is the highest compliment you can give somebody. But she was always clear she would do her best to support and encourage everyone to participate in a way that made them feel comfortable. Anyone can tell you that Rachel cares about her work, she cares about this campus, and she definitely cares about her students. Each and every class, I sat with my jaw dropped, listening to her passion and enthusiasm envelop the room. She knew me well as a student and knew that I could actually do it if I really tried and didn't let my anxieties take over. Her knowledge, wisdom, and advice have been so crucial to my learning that my college experience as a whole would have been greatly diminished without her presence. Whenever I talk to other students who are planning on taking English classes, I tell them how incredible Rachel Cole is and recommend taking as many classes with her as possible. That's what I did. If anyone on this campus deserves recognition for enriching the lives of students at Lewis and Clark, it is definitely Rachel Cole. When I look back on my college experience, Joel Martinez stands out as the most influential teacher I've had here at Lewis and Clark. Joel treats his students with respect and grace. Joel was the first teacher that sat me down, looked me seriously in the eye, and told me that my presence in the Lewis and Clark community was not only sufficient, but valuable. Every classroom feels comfortable and open in a way that stimulates learning and connection. Currently, Joel is pioneering a program that bridges the gap between the humanities and STEM by spearheading interdisciplinary research into ethics and computer science. Joel leads by example and is a mentor to all of the students he interacts with. Without Joel, the high level of intellectual and emotional community that we experience in the philosophy department and at Lewis and Clark would not exist. Ending my senior year, our meetings are no, long, no longer consist of whether or not I should continue college, but my options concerning grad school. I will take Joel's teachings, mentorship, enthusiasm, and social dedication with me for the rest of my life. Joel deserves this award because it's teachers like him that give students like me a chance to find our voice in academic walls. There is no doubt in my mind, or the mind of my peers, that Joel deserves the recognition of Teacher of the Year. I can honestly call Lewis and Clark my home away from home specifically because of the work that Joel has done to make this community feel welcoming and safe. Listening to Professor Campion speak for just a couple minutes, you'll immediately get the impression that he's one of the most intelligent people you've ever met. Every time I walk into the classroom, I'm confronted with a new way to look, not just at the First World War, but also at our current world and society at large. After I went to Professor Campion's office hours just the first time, um, it sent me into a bit of a crisis because talking to him reminded me how much I truly love history. To every class, he also brings in artifacts from the war, such as helmets, medallions, and other period items. 
And after visiting his office hours a couple more times, I decided to change my major to history. He looks at the war from so many different angles and viewpoints, which underscore the complexity of the time, which is easily, easily lost when flipping through a textbook. Professor Campion is one of those extremely rare teachers that will just change your life and the way you see the world. I cannot wait to take another course by him. This class has been one of the best of my life and I thank him for that. I feel that his teaching is truly remarkable and deserves the highest recognition. My first experience with Drew was one that would shape my college career going forward. This semester, Drew took on the task of advising me through the process of applying for an artist residency program at Yale Norfolk. She says that she tries to think of the teachers and mentors she's had, how they've impacted her, and how she tries to do the same with her students. She is caring, generous, uplifting, dedicated, and organized, among many other things. She makes me feel like I belong in the art department, like I have a place, and I'm sure that many other students think the same as well. Being an international student who has to stay on campus, I feel very looked after by Drew. She checked in on me in regards to my mental health, my plans, and whether I need anything she could provide. Drew's logic and passion made me realize that planning for the future and taking this risk would be the right decision for me. It must not have been easy, but Drew definitely took advantage of our current situation academically. I'm amazed at how she plans 10 total hours a week of compelling content for two virtual classes. And even reaching out to professional artists to join our video conferences each week. Drew put her career and reputation and friendships on the line in order to make each and every one of us have the best experience possible. In the next couple of years as an alumnus, she'll definitely be one of the people I think of when I think of Lewis and Clark. I can say with confidence the New York trip with Drew Donovan has changed my life for the better and she deserves more credit than she has received thus far. I can tell she clearly shows trust and respect for her students and in turn her students trust and respect her immensely as well. She's devoted to helping her students develop deep levels of understanding and never makes you feel uncomfortable or like you are behind for not fully digesting a topic. Um, and I didn't have to ask her to help me. She just volunteered to do so. And it's one of the kindest things anyone's ever done for me at LC. This approach leads to a sense of trust between Dr. Benley and her students, which I've seen on a number of occasions. And it just showed me how well-meaning and kind she is. And she deserves to be recognized for this. She would give me confidence that one score did not define me and that there are plenty of students who just need to dive into the material more. It allowed me to refocus on my studies instead of trying to find another job. Overall, I feel that Dr. Bentley should be Teacher of the Year because she puts in more effort outside of class than any other professor I've seen and never ever sacrifices the knowledge and academic competence of her students for time efficiency. I'm eternally grateful for her and Lewis and Clark is very lucky to have her. Dr. Bentley is one of the most knowledgeable professors I've ever met, but what makes her Teacher of the Year is her ability to translate that knowledge to a younger audience. After hearing the extract of some of the letters, you can imagine how difficult it was to choose the winner for this award. All five finalists demonstrated the qualities of an ideal Teacher of the Year candidate, such as passion for their field of study, diverse learning styles, and compassion as a mentor. The committee has decided to give this year's Teacher of the Year award to... Drew Donovan. Among other qualities, Drew demonstrated adaptability to the new format of virtual learning and had a great input in students' future by developing them professionally outside of the academic setting. Congratulations on this award and thank you for taking such a formative role for the Lewis and Clark community. We're also inviting you to deliver an address at this year's convocation during a new student orientation period. Thank you so much for watching this video and see you next academic year.